In this video, I will demonstrate how to navigate through an entity. So within CRM, we can see that just by dropping down sales, there's a list of numerous entities that you can select. So from here, I'm going to select contacts. The first thing you'll notice when the entity opens is that there's a list of contact names, as well as different columns for emails, company names, and business phone numbers. To the right, you'll notice a chart designer, which can be expanded to create charts from the information within this entity. And I show that in another video. Now by clicking on this icon, all of the columns will be given a filter, and from there you can choose how to sort and search through the data. You can also create a custom filter. So if I click filter on company name and select custom filter, I can then choose to filter my data for company names that begin with C-O-N. And then by selecting OK, we can see the results. Then to go back, you can also reset the filter. Also, when you click the filter on any of the columns, you'll notice that the filters will sort A to Z or Z to A, which is automatically done any time you select a column. For example, full name is already filtered A to Z by default, but by clicking the full name again, it will filter the data Z to A. You are also capable of changing the view. So by selecting the drop down menu on My Active Contacts, you'll notice a list of views to choose from. So here I'm going to select Primary Contacts. And then you'll notice the view change. And that is how to navigate through an entity and change the view.